According to the Portuguese colonizers of Angola, citizens were supposed to be treated fairly regardless of race. However, this one nation propaganda was only a smokescreen to hide something truly evil. Many races, one nation was one of the principles that the Portuguese implemented with its colonial grasp over Angola. While those words sound nice in theory, it masked a horrifying reality. Theory is one of the primary ways the Portuguese kept colonial rule over Angola. Their biggest weapon, lusotropicalism, was supposed to eliminate discrimination, but there was something very wrong about this theory. Lusotropicalism was invented in the 1950s by a cultural historian who suggested the Portuguese were more empathetic than other European colonizers and championed miscegenation as a way to make Angola and other countries more diverse, yet still Portuguese. However, this junk science couldn't have made Angola more at odds. Lusotropicalism forced unwanted interracial relationships on Black women, while also restricting Black people from roles of authority and politics. Angola gained its independence in 1975, but these fraudulent social concepts that are supposed to help Black people still live on today. We still face opposing forces that create ideologies to advance narratives that fit their quest for power and that erases our history. It's important we continue to honor and discover our history and challenge theories and practices that deceive and harm our people. We all know schools aren't teaching Black history correctly. That's why Push Black is so important. Will you support truthful, accurate, empowering Black history content with a donation? Click the link in our bio to donate now.